Production Technology of Guards Part 1 At the end of this lesson, you will be able to explain the origin and distribution of bitter god. Describe the general characteristic features of bitter god. Explain the practices involved in bitter god cultivation. Nothing can replace mother's cooking. However delightful the outside food may be, isn't it? But still, there are certain food items that we would commonly say no, even when it is cooked by our beloved mother. One such food item is the bitter god curry. It is one of the most hated vegetables by most of the population, especially children, because of its bitter taste. But have you ever wondered why our mothers prefer to cook it? The reason is very simple. Bitter God has many medicinal and nutritional benefits. Bitter God mainly consists of water content and is considered to be a rich source for vitamin C and vitamin B9. In addition, it also contains dietary fibers, minerals and antioxidants which are beneficial to health. Ayurveda and naturopathy also suggest that Regular consumption of bitter gourd juice can cure many complications relating to diabetes, asthma, allergy, ulceration, etc. Thus, bitter gourd is deemed to be one of the important food items in the Indian culinary. In this lesson, we shall discuss on bitter gourd in detail. Bitter gourd belongs to the family of Cucurbitaceae, which includes more than 900 species. Among them, bitter gourd is an important vegetable belonging to the genus Momodesa. It is one of the vegetable crops which belong to the Old World origin, a native of tropical Asia, especially to the Indo-Burma region. It was first domesticated in India and was widely cultivated in the regions of eastern India, southern China and Africa. Later, slave trade introduced bitter gourd from Africa to Brazil. Seed dispersal by birds is also one of the reasons for its existence in the tropical regions of the world. Currently, it is grown in countries like India, China, Indonesia, Malaysia, Africa, South America, etc. Among them, India is one of the leading producers of bitter gourd with around 769.59 tons produced during 2014 to 2015 alone. Maximum yield was reported from the regions of Chhattisgarh and Orissa. The varieties of bitter gourd available in India are Momodika charantia. It is the cultivated type of bitter gourd. Momodika charantia var murketa. It is a small fruit, highly bitter and is of wild type. Momodika dioica, otherwise known as spinning guard. Momodika cochinchinensis, otherwise known as sweet guard of Assam. Momodika balsamana, the immature fruits are used as a vegetable or pickled. Now let us discuss on the botanical description of Momodika charentia, the most common variety of bitter guard. Bitter guard or Momodika charentia is of monoecious type. It is an annual climber with crop duration of about 100 to 120 days. The leaves are palmate, consisting 5 to 9 lobes. Flowers are yellow in color, axillary and has long pedicel. The flowers consist of united anthers and 5 stamens with free filaments. Stigma is divided. Anthesis, that is, the flowering occurs between. 4 a.m. and 7 a.m. Pollen loses its viability on the same day. Hence, hand pollination is necessary. The fruits are of fusiform type, pendulous and consist of numerous tubercles. The fruit are generally bitter in nature due to the presence of an alkaloid, momodicin. Now let us discuss on the cultivation practices of bitter guard in detail. Bitter gourd is generally a warm season crop which requires an ideal temperature of about 25 to 30 degrees Celsius for optimal yield. A well-drained loam or sandy loam soil with a pH of about 
6 to 7 is suitable for optimal yield. Land preparation. Generally, cultivation of bitter gourd requires well prepared land. The land is ploughed to fine tilled stage and pits of 60 cm diameter and 30 to 45 cm depth are made with a spacing of 2 to 2.5 into 2 to 2.5 meters, followed by which farmyard manure is applied onto the pits at a rate of 20 to 25 tons per hectare. The pits are then filled with the top soil up to three-fourths of the pit's height. Sowing of Seeds Bittergard is chiefly cultivated through seeds. Two to three months old seeds are soaked overnight in cold water and then stored in a moist cloth for one to two days, allowing germination of seeds. Then, four to five seeds are sown in each pit at a rate of five to six kilograms per hectare. Generally, the seeds are sown either during the month of January or July. Thinning is done to maintain two to three seedlings per pit. Gap filling is also done. Staking, trellising and pruning will optimize the vine growth, increase the fruit yield and size, reduce fruit rot and make spraying and harvesting easier. Fertilizer application. In addition to the farmyard manure, 100 grams of NPK is applied to each pit at a ratio of 6 is to 12 is to 12 as a basal dose. 10 grams of nitrogen fertilizer alone is applied to each pit after 30 days of sowing. Fertilizer application can also be carried out in 5 to 6 split doses as the harvesting is carried out frequently. Irrigation After sowing, Irrigation is carried out once in a week depending on the type of soil. However, regular irrigation at an interval of 2 to 5 days specifically at the fruiting stage is highly necessary for optimal growth and yield. Intercultural operations Frequent hand weeding and hoeing of soil along with the application of fertilizers is carried out for controlling the weeds. Intercultural equipments are generally avoided since bitter gourd is a shallow rooted crop. Harvesting and yield. Harvesting is carried out after 55 to 60 days of sowing, whereas picking of fruits is carried out when they are fully grown, provided that the fruits are still tender and young. Harvesting is carried out twice a week, whereas 15 to 20 harvests are possible for a good crop. Shelf life of bitter gourd is very less and hence is sold as early as possible. Yield of around 11 to 25 tons per hectare of bitter gourd is achieved. The seed yield is around 200 to 250 kilograms per hectare. Now let us discuss about the diseases and pests affecting bitter gourd cultivations. Diseases Common diseases which affect the bitter gourd vines are powdery mildew and downy mildew. Powdery mildew can be controlled by spraying carbendazium at 0.5 grams per liter of water. Downy mildew can be controlled by spraying mancozeb at 2 grams per liter of water twice at an interval of 10 days. Pests Mites, beetles, fruit flies and caterpillars are the common pests which affect bitter guard. Mites can be controlled by spraying Dicofol 18.5% EC at 2.5 mm per liter of water. Beetles, fruit flies and caterpillars can be controlled by spraying Malathion 50 EC at 1 ml per liter of water. Summary Bittergard is a crop of Old World with its native to Tropical Asia. Bittergard has many medicinal and nutritional benefits. Bittergard is propagated through seeds or seedlings and a yield of around 11 to 25 tons per hectare can be achieved.